So guys, in this video, we are gonna be talking about gel application in the shower. I do have another video up, but this video, I tried to talk, do a talk through while I'm doing the application in the shower. There are a few things that I think is necessary if you want your UFD application to go on right and it not being sticky and to get enough water to gel ratio. One of the things that I think you need to do is, is to apply your gel in the shower. If you cannot apply your gel at the sink or have a bowl of water or something there to wet your hair. The little spray bottle thing, I don't think it gives you enough water, honestly. I can't tell when last I've used my spray bottle. So I think it's necessary for you to actually have something to dip your hair in. Either dip it on there if you're in the kitchen or whatever, dip it in there and get it wet and then apply your gel. I think that's the best way to get your ratio correct. But I will, I haven't gone over the video yet, but I'll see, hopefully I don't have to do a voiceover because you know, with the water and everything. But hopefully this video is gonna be helpful in helping to, you to get your water to gel ratio. It's not gonna be perfect. Everyone has different density in their hair. We don't all use the same amount of gel. So it's just you getting your routine down so that you can up, know how much water, how much gel does my hair need. And one of the things that I notice is if once, when your hair is soaking wet and you apply that gel, once you have had enough, it automatically, for me, the water stopped dripping. One of the other things that I notice is, remember when you used to put oil on your hair and you have that smooth feeling? I know when I have enough gel when my hair is smooth, I'm not feeling, I'm feeling like my each, each um, curl is covered. That's how I know when I have enough gel. Another thing you can do is hold it up and do that little motion and if you hear it, you can know you have um, but that doesn't always work. One of the things that works for me is making sure I mean, I have access to water to dip my hair. That's what makes me feel like I have enough water. And when the hair is soaking wet, I apply the gel. Guys, I hope this video is going to be helpful. Hopefully, it's going to help you. That's why I'm making the video. But anyway, guys, please don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you again in another video. So the first thing you want to do is you want to dip your hair under the water. You see the water is dripping out of my hair. You brush through. If I wasn't on here, I would dip my hair again. But since I don't want to turn the water on so that you can't hear me, I can't do that. But you dip your hair under again one more time. Get your gel. I'm using UFD. You're going to emulsify it in your hand like this. Then you're going to start from the ends and you're going to work it up. This part is just applying the gel, so you're not looking to define anything right now. You're just applying. I took another, and everyone's hair needs more or less UFD. Not everyone's hair is the same. Everybody's going to need a little different amount to, um, to their curls. It's just... You just have to gauge and try to figure out how much you need on your hair. And I have a mirror right here, because you do need a mirror when you're doing this process in the shower, just to see what you're doing, see if it's on there or whatever. At this point, I would turn the water back on. I'm gonna turn the water back on. I'm going to get a little blob of water and I'm going to put it on my hair. Grab some more. I feel like I need more. So I'm going to grab some more and I'm just going to go like this. And I think I have enough. One thing you notice, if you are notice water is dripping from your hair, maybe you need more gel. And you can do that test too. I'm going to take this part out. Okay, you're going to dip it under the water like this. You don't want to get the water on the other part that you have already done. So then, this, brush through all the way 
out. Pick one more. Water dripping. See? Okay. Good job. So guys, now I know I have enough gel in my hair. No water is dripping. You can do the test. But one of the things I find is if you can feel that feeling on your hair. If you remember when you used to put oil on your hair, it needs to feel a little bit slippery. So if you're feeling your hair still feeling um, rough like um, wool, or if that's your texture, you know you need a little more. It needs to be gliding, it needs to be smooth. For me, that's how I know I have enough UFD on my hair. And another thing that makes me know I have enough UFD is the water stops dripping. So that's it guys. I hope this new tutorial will help you with your application of your UFD in the shower. Anyway, Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you again in another video.